Another game I really like this week is Kansas at plus 16 and a half. Um, they're playing at Texas. A little bit of a look ahead spot for Texas. They got Oklahoma next week. Um, I think Kansas got the has the offense to to keep up with Texas's offense. I know Texas has that great defense, um, but I, I like I like Kansas here to keep it within sixteen and a half. You know, I got them. They could lose them by two touchdowns, keeping it close. They'll probably be down 21, 20, 22 late. Get an easy touchdown in the back door cover. Um, so I like I like Kansas here. I just think it's too many points. I think I think the spread should be closer to about 12, 10. Over in that 11 range, I'm thinking 16 and a half right now is too much. You could probably maybe wait, and uh, it might go up to 17 even. Um, I, I, I really like Kansas here getting um, 16 and a half points. Yeah, I'm not probably playing this game. I could see this going both ways. Um, I love Jalen Daniels. We've talked about him several times on the show. I yes, think he's yes, a stud. Yes. I think he could single-handedly carry Kansas. Uh, but my concern is we saw what happened when they traveled to Nevada and almost lost that game to Nevada as 28-point favorites. Here they're traveling to Texas, right? So I just don't trust them as much on the road. Um, on the they field. are – sorry to interject. They are a much better team as an underdog than a heavy favorite. I will say that. Fair enough, fair enough. I mean, and, and obviously – Texas is good. I could see this being a little bit of a letdown spot for them after, you know, how much business they've taken care of. They just smashed Baylor on the road. Exactly. Um, they got Oklahoma coming up. That's a big game. Um, you know, I kind of I, – I do like – I like where Kansas is. I like the spot they're in right now where they're playing them on the schedule. You know, if they um, – if it was different – if the schedule was laid out differently – you know, I'm not necessarily taking Kansas here, but I love the spot for them uh, and and getting 16. You know, I could see a slow start from Texas and and coming back and, you know, taking care of business at the end. And like I said, they could be down 22, 23 points at the end of the game. And we all know college football, they're going to get, especially with, with Daniels, they're going to get that easy touchdown with four minutes left to go ahead and sneak that, that back door in. Yeah, so. I definitely don't mind the play. Um, I also like the over 61 currently on DraftKings. I think it's also a good play because we know Texas is going to put up points. And I can see, like we've talked about, uh, Kansas quarterback scrambling around, making plays, and getting them in the end zone three, four times as well. So, Yeah, Kansas scored game. 30 points all every year. I know they haven't played a defense as good as Texas, but I think uh, Kansas at least is going to put up what bare minimum 24 28 points um so i think uh I, I, like i said i like them 17 i agree with you paul the over is a good play in this game as well yeah especially if you think kansas is going to cover because they're not going to cover if it's you know a low scoring game there i don't think they're covering that more of a shootout type game i think they get that covering good deal what's your next play here nate 